Now for these molecules, you're supposed to classify them under E or the Z isomer, or neither. <laughs> Take some time to analyze the stereochemistry for this alkene. Let me go through now. So at the double bond, we always divide this way. We look to the left first and assign the priority groups. A metal C with a triple H pedigree. At the bottom, C, C. So we count ooh. carbon against carbon, they are the same. This carbon on top joins to hydrogen. But the carbon below joins to a carbon, hydrogen, hydrogen. So the bottom part becomes a higher priority, and we check this. On the right hand side, we go one by one again. Carbon and carbon is the same, carbon is the same, but at the top, you have more carbon, which is of a high priority. So the top is a high priority, and you see the ticks now are on the opposite side of the double bond. So this means it is an E isomer. For the case below, see, carbon of a methyl group against carbon of an isopropyl group, we can go further to carbon, to more carbon. So this stops at HHH. So hydrogen's atomic number is smaller than carbon. So you can't beat this guy. Check the bottom part as a high priority. On the other side, same thing, methyl group C ends with triple H. At the bottom, an ethyl group, carbon, HH, and a carbon, high priority. So the same high priority on the bottom side. So we call it Z. Next up, you can see that the top one is of a high priority because you can go branch carbon, more carbons, and carbon H's are the lowest priority. So this guy wins. And for the other side, this is the one that wins because you go carbon. The bottom one has two carbons connected to it, whereas the top one only has one carbon. So this guy beats the top. Opposite, that must be an E. Next example. You cut here first, and then you analyze. What you notice is, for this carbon of the double bond, it's attached to identical fluorine atom, which means there's no way to assign the priority because it's a draw. It's the same thing, which means in this case, there's no easy, okay, it's easy. <laughs> it's neither, okay? It's quite easy for you, but neither. We cannot classify this as E or Z. Next molecule. Carbon with a Br. Carbon with hydrogen. Hydrogen, again, has the smallest atomic number. Everything will beat hydrogen, okay, if you have a nucleus of an atom here. So check the top one, high priority. And for the other side, we are having Br against a carbon. You see, we go one bond by one bond. Carbon against Br, this guy has a higher atomic number. So on the same side of the double bond, this is a Z. And for the last case, you realize that on the left, it's just identical metal groups. So again, neither. Try to practice this, take a look again and again, and make sure you understand it well.